Hey guys, what's up? It's Zar here from Zar Concepts, and today I'm going to be doing like a kind of a story time type of thing, uh, speaking about my in real life experiences because I don't really do this. But you guys have been begging me for new series, and I thought I might as well just start this. So on January the 6th, which is today, I got in about one of the biggest fights I've ever gotten with my parents. It all started with my mom coming downstairs, interrupting me while I'm trying to trick shoot some little little bitches on Xbox. I try my best. I put my heart into it and I don't hit shit but that's not the point and she came downstairs and she was like hey you're going to the mall I was like no I'm not and what do you expect typical parents she flips shit pulls me upstairs and starts fighting with me just because I don't want to go to the mall and she understands I hate the mall because what happens is that my sister ends up getting like $300 worth of clothes and we spend about five hours there and I don't even get ice cream like come on you should leave my ice cream if you love me but she doesn't I know that and all my friends do too that's not the point. So we start fighting, and then my stepdad comes downstairs and threatens me like he always does. And he was flipping shit, so what happens? Bowls start to break, glasses start to break. I actually felt pretty good when I slammed that glass plate on the ground. It shattered. It made me laugh. But yeah, they get on the biggest fight, and they told me to move with my dad. And if you guys don't know, really know me that well, you know that I do want to move with my dad, and I am actually next year. Because I have a few people that are actually moving out the school district and I might as well go into. And my dad lives about 40 minutes away so my parents personally drive me to my dad's house to drop me off. Before they did that they didn't know that I did secretly pick up my Xbox from my where it is on the desk. I replaced my Xbox Elite with my Xbox Slim so it looked like I didn't bring my Xbox. I only brought the cord that plugs into the TV the HD cord so I left my PVR there. I kept it on because I know I wasn't recording for the past three days, so kept it there. And it kind of makes it look like that I didn't bring my Xbox, which I think I did pretty well. So I bring all my games, I bring my controller, I bring my battery pack. But one thing I did not bring was my controller charger. And I was thinking that ahead of time because I thought I had it in a bag, but I didn't. So I brought my extra battery pack, which I thought was the one that you put the batteries into. But apparently it wasn't, so I was playing Xbox, playing some Grand Theft Auto, and my controller dies. I'm like, oh, whatever. Brought my controller charger. I didn't find that, so I wasn't worried because I had a backup. So I got out my other battery pack, and luckily, you know, my luck, it wasn't a, a battery pack. It was a charger one that you had to plug into the Xbox. So right away, I knew I was screwed. I kept on searching everywhere. And I figured out that I brought both of my rechargeable ones, but that one rechargeable one I lost for about six months and I couldn't find. And I would never have thought to check where I checked. It was in one of my other controllers I never used because I was like, oh, hey, I never use this controller, might as well just bring its battery back. So I was thinking ahead of time, being all smart, and my cockiness actually did get me screwed. So now I've been searching YouTube videos though for about the past four hours, and I have no life actually. Um, and it's, it kind of sucks because you know that moment when you think everyone everything has gone right it just it's a smack in the face you're just like fuck god damn it just fuck and that's how I felt I had one of those moments so and I was gonna go watch TV and my step or not my stepdad my dad actually did take down the satellite so now I'm stuck here without TV or my Xbox and I am basically lonely now and if you guys can come here and give me a hug I'll be very happy so that's really all I gotta say is my parents still hate me my dad loves me he gets me everything I love him and I got hot chocolate for Christmas but I did get a $15 gift certificate for Taco Bell for my birthday I'm thankful for that and if you guys want another series uh, post it in the comments below and as always if you like this video please leave a penis in the comments I appreciate all those penises it shows that you guys support me and I support you and that's all I gotta say guys and have a great day I love you all